Coming up next week, Greece, anti-terrorism and a mini plenary. Welcome to the agenda. For weeks, it's been the most talked about subject. Well, what exactly new legislation on passenger name record will or won't do, we'll finally know when the draft proposal is officially unveiled. It all kicks off on Thursday when the new report will be presented by its author. Last time around, it failed to pass go. Will it be green-lighted? It's seen as a tool to fight the latest wave of terrorist attacks. But does it do enough to maintain privacy and data protection? French talks between Greece and its creditors, can a deal be salvaged? Or is Greece looking ever closer to a Eurozone exit? The European Central Bank has thrown Greece a lifeline by giving it over 3 billion in liquidity for banks. So what will the president of the Eurogroup, Jerome Dazelbloom, have to say when he comes to the parliament on Tuesday? Greece will continue to be the talk of the town the day after, as a mini plenary hits Brussels. On Wednesday, look out for a debrief of the EU Heads of State meeting held on February 12th. Also at the Parliament, the President of the European Central Bank, Mario Draghi. He'll be there for the unveiling of the ECB's 2013 annual report. Will he make any statements on Greece? Intense shelling by pro-Russian rebels saw a hasty retreat by Ukrainian forces from Devalseve on Wednesday. So where does the peace process go from here? On Tuesday, the chairperson of the Ukrainian Rada comes to the Foreign Affairs Committee. The meeting comes on the back of the chair of the Russian Duma's visit to the Strasbourg plenary in the week just past. And finally, the Environment Committee will vote on reform of the emissions trading system on Tuesday. Plans include automatic backloading or delay of emission allowance to drive up the price of carbon and get a better balance between supply and demand. But when all of that will come into play is also subject for dispute. And that's all we have for this agenda. Take care and enjoy the week.